here's an exercise of what can be done with a T-model Ford engine. Now with the bonnet up, we can see that it's only half of a T-model Ford engine. The back two cylinders are cut off because the crankshaft originally broke in the back half and smashed all the back main bearing up. So we made it into a half a T-model Ford engine and added the transmission later. We'll have a look how that works soon too. Also the coil box has been cut in half and we've got half of uh, half of the number of coils that it originally had. So it's just got the two driving number one and number two cylinder. The firing order of a T-model Ford was one, two, four, three. Uh, even firing, but now with four and three taken off, the firing order is still one, two, miss, miss, one, two, miss, miss, so it runs like a, a John Deere tractor, the two cylinder models. Okay, we'll now start the engine up, switch the coil on, choke it. Now we'll just demonstrate briefly how the transmission works. That's the brake, that's the first gear band, and now that's the reverse gear band. When you put your foot on the pedal of the brake, the tail shaft stops turning, of course. Put it on the first gear pedal, and it goes in low gear, and uh, in the middle pedal, which is reverse, puts on the reverse band and reverses the tail shaft. The top gear, the clutch is just engaged and the uh, tail shaft spins then at the same speed as the motor.